Hello Earth citizens! In this video, I will show you a 10-minute routine to do for an upset stomach or indigestion. So when you have an upset stomach or indigestion, it's typically in this area over here and it kind of bleed down. So I will do a routine to kind of help you loosen up any tension, blockage you have in your stomach, your third chakra, and then your intestinal tract down here, okay? So I recommend doing this sitting down on a chair. If it's very uncomfortable, you can do lying down, but actually you'll get a better stimulation, better massage if you do it sitting up rather than lying down, okay? So sit comfortably in your chair, and first let's place our hands on our knees and take a few breaths in. Close your eyes, breathe in through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Try to relax your shoulders and let everything just come down. Two more breaths. Breathe in. And exhale. One last time. Breathe in. When you exhale, try to let everything sink from your shoulders all the way down your torso to your tailbone. Ha. Okay, now gently open your eyes and now make a fist. So tuck your thumbs in, roll your fingers around your thumb. And then with the pinky side, gently tap your third chakra here at the base of your diaphragm, right here. Gently, very lightly, as if you're lightly knocking on a door to open, just very lightly. Now the first instinct when you have pain here is to crunch up your shoulders, okay? If you notice your shoulders going up, Bring your shoulders down and lightly tap, lightly tap. Keep your jaw slightly open. Exhale out through your mouth. Very lightly. With the intention of breaking up small blockages that might be in your third chakra right now. The key is to exhale out through your mouth, okay? Release any blockage. And also, is your spine straight? If you hunch over like this, you're closing your third chakra. So make sure your spine is straight, your third chakra is open. Let's tap here for one minute. Breathe out through your mouth. Ha, lightly tap. If you feel pain, say to yourself, I love my pain. Ha. You can make sound too if it helps you release some tension. Let's go 30 more seconds. Ah. Ah. Feel your third chakra. You might feel like you're tensing up because it's painful. Release the tension. Ah. Ah, I know it sounds counterintuitive and pretty difficult, but when you feel yourself crunching, open your third chakra. Let's go 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Now move your hands to your left side of your body. I think this is mirror image for you, but from here, the left side is your stomach area, okay? So right above your stomach, which is at the base of your rib cage, right here, let's tap your stomach with the same kind of lightness, like you're trying to release tension from a tight stomach, okay? When you tap, you'll notice your stomach wanting to crunch because there's pain there. Go against that kind of instinct and relax, release your stomach like you're like that, okay? So tap here, tap your stomach. Again, open your stomach. Don't crunch like this. Open, lightly tap. When you tap, send love to your stomach. I love you, my stomach. And breathe out through your mouth here too. Through your exhale, you are guiding any stuffy energy, tense energy that has been accumulated here out of your body, out through your mouth. Ah. 
<sighs> Is your stomach relaxing? Or are you tensing up? Relax your stomach, relax your shoulders. Lightly tap. Ha. <sighs> Ah, 30 seconds. Ah, I love my stomach. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two one and stop now let's go down to your lower abdomen two inches below your navel two inches inside tap tap here this is the center of your body we're gonna go clockwise like this tap close your eyes imagine this one you're tapping a little bit stronger to ground your energy tap into your lower abdomen breathe out one minute here too. Tap deeply here in your lower abdomen to ground your energy. Uh, exhale out through your mouth. Thirty seconds. If you have the movement down, I recommend closing your eyes so you can focus on your body. <sighs> Exhale out any tension from your body through your mouth. <sighs> ah. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two one and stop good now we're gonna go top right side so top right here is your liver okay so here lightly tap like you tap lightly up here on the top right side your liver this is mirror image for you on the top right side tap your liver as if you are stamping loving energy into your liver gently knocking on your liver to release blockage Exhale out through your mouth. I love my liver. Your liver is your body's filter. So it filters out all the food, vitamins, all the things that are toxic for your body. It filters it out. So please send loving, healing energy to your liver for one minute. Thirty seconds. Notice if you're crunching up your liver, relax your liver. Especially if you have pain, it's very natural for us to kind of crunch up. Go against that instinct and open. Relax. Ha. Tell your body it's okay. It's okay. I can allow my body to open. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one stop now the last point we will tap is between the third chakra and the second chakra right in the middle here this is where your small intestines are okay so right in the middle tap again push out from the back so you can open rather than crunching in like this okay push from the back open one minute here too relax breathe out through your mouth ha. tap lightly to open, open, say hello, I'm here. <laughs> Tap and exhale out for one minute. 
Notice your shoulders. Are your shoulders relaxed? Is your small intestine relaxing and opening? Breathe out. 30 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Okay, now we're gonna do a little bit of a massaging. So again, this is your mirror image, but get from the bottom right side of your body, bottom right side, move up, over, and down like this to the bottom left side. So again, from the bottom right, up, over and down let's do this five times from here bottom right up across one and with your fingers try to push like you're massaging something through let's go two up across and down three up across and down four up across so you can feel your colon here and down number four up across you feel your colon and down one more time up across and down okay now with your palms without pushing start from your lower abdomen and now gently rub clockwise clockwise and say to your hands and to your intestines my hands are healing hands like this gently rubbing your abdomen you can close your eyes to feel your body a little bit better feel the movement of your palms around your abdomen and please say my hands are healing hands my hands are healing hands. Move your hands with intention as if they really are healing hands, sending healing energy to your intestines. My hands are healing hands. 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 Feel the warmth of your palms on your abdomen. My hands are healing hands. You may feel some tingling if you're sensitive to energy. Feel healing energy coming from your hands into your intestines. My hands are healing hands. My hands are healing hands. My hands are healing hands. Let's say this to each other three more times. My hands are healing hands. My hands are healing hands. My hands are healing hands. Great job. Place your hands on your lower abdomen. Keep your eyes closed. Feel your lower abdomen. Feel your breath. Notice any energy sensation in your body, such as tingling, warmth, coldness, magnetism. Feel the depth and length of your breath. Maybe you can feel your heartbeat too. Notice any sensations in your body. And one last time, tell yourself, my hands are healing hands. Take a breath in through your nose. Exhale out through your mouth.
Again, breathe in through your nose. Exhale out through your mouth. One last time, breathe in. Bend your upper body forward, exhale. And return. Open your eyes. How do you feel? If you feel, if you still feel a little bit of tension in your abdomen, that's okay. Feel free to watch this 10 minute routine again to get more energy circulating and moving in your gut so that you can feel that relaxation. But here, after you do this routine one time, can you feel even a slight difference? Maybe your body feels more relaxed, something feels a little bit more moving, something feels a little bit more warm in your hands. Notice any changes you feel after having done this routine once. And if you feel like you need a little bit deeper of a stimulation, feel free to watch this 10 minute routine again. You did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you. Or if you don't live near a body and brain center, check out our YouTube online membership.